Bro, Archer's really her servant. Are you telling big man Archer to bring your overnight bag, bro? Say, but let him know. Alright. The only reason Archer knows what Shido's going through is because he was him. I figured it out. I think I figured it out. <laughs> Yo, YouTube, it's your boy M. Listen, we're back again with some more Fate. We got Fate Unlimited Blade Works episodes 11. And, bro, last episode was so nutty, bro. In a nutshell, um we 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 jumped uh kuzuki caster's master and he cooked us i'm not gonna lie he cooked us and to the point where shido was able to like summon two jill blades the same way archer can yeah question mark question mark for real um and so we ended up getting out of there alive uh but not only that gilgamesh is cooking up something super devious I, and Shinji is just there for revenge. So I really don't know how all of these stories are going to intertwine and combine and how this is going to end, but I'm looking forward to this, bro. Literally, like, yeah, I'm there with you guys, man. I need this. So without further ado, chat, let's just jump into this episode. Let's get it. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, she got her back blown out, bro. She got saluted. Don't worry, bro. He heals quick. That Avalon is going to kick in quick. Oh. Never mind. I was trying to shit. Hold on. What's going on here? These are the after effects of using the projection stuff. But there's magic circuits. Oh, is that what that is? Interesting. Oh, yeah, you're not good, bro. You are not okay. Yeah, of course he has. Yeah. <laughs> Why did you just close it back up? <laughs> yeah, freeloader. Chat, I'm bugging. So, you know I'm seeing a blue sweater? However, on my screen, I'm seeing a green sweater. That's freaking me out. Wait, chat. The green screen effect. It has to be, huh? Yo, what the hell? Yo, look, yeah, you know, you're right. Look. Chat, oh my days. Look, the green seaweed looks blue on your screen. Nah, that's throwing me off. Hmm. I feel like she's the type to do so. Yeah. Bro, imagine a Rin and Saber like Master Servant Link up, bro. That'd be kind of crazy. I don't know, you are different because you're trying to kill me literally like three episodes ago. Wow, he's getting tag team now, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Where is Sakura, by the way? We ain't seen her in a while. Ain't Sakura supposed to be staying with us? Yeah, 
人間の情を感じるこの屋敷はすごく自然なのよ魔術師の工房のくせに開けてる入るのも帰るのもご自由にって感じ当坂のうちは違うの No, the complete opposite 違う父さんの後を継ぐのは義務だけどそれだって楽しくなければやらないわエミア君と協力してるのだってあなたが面白いからだし Okay I like this little uh One to one conversation we're having between Rin and Shira right here. Oh, she's talking about Majutsu. Hey, he's a simple man. So, what do you think about Majutsu? Why is she getting so offended over this? Yeah. Okay. そんな余分な願いを持つ資格がないと。うーん。あへる。言いなさい。君あんた。人のことばっかりで、自分に焦点があってないのよ。大丈夫だ。ちょっと。うるさい。口答えするな。あのもう。似てる似てるって思ってたけど。まさかここまで一緒とは思わなかった。落ち着け、父さん。talking about。ええ、ええ、し、talking about。し、talking about。あっちまへ。明日。あんたに参ったのは、やるから。まさか、いつかの続きをする気か。Yeah. Oh, she got a trump card. Oh. Bro. Arch is really her servant. Like, really her servant. Like, are you telling big man Archer to bring your overnight bag, bro? What? And he just said yes, bro. I'm telling you, it's like command spell. He was like, he brushed it off like that command spell had no effect on me. Bro, ever since she did that command spell, like first episode, he'd been hooked. He'd, he's been doing whatever she wanted. Ooh. My thing is, Jaya. Does Saber remember anything from the previous Holy Grail War? Does she not remember anything? Because this is ain't this the set kind of like same Saber that was there from before? So she kind of knew how Karisugu like was as a person. If she does remember, like or does retain her memories. Naruto, <laughs> Mm, he never knew the real Karetsugu though. Hold on. He wasn't always like that. How was the Avalon lock picked in though? Oh, do you know something about that? Hey, Archer must know, bro. Talking from experience. Fact, this is solidify my theory even more. Hey, this nigga's using Trace on too. Fortifying his muscles, yeah? Say, but let him know. Alright, he went through something similar, chat. Alright. The only reason Archer knows what Shido's going through is because he was him at one point. But he just doesn't remember. Archer just doesn't remember. And obviously, with Shido, he hasn't gone through the things Archer has gone through. So he doesn't know about Archer like that. Hmm. お前の欲望が誰も傷つけないという理想であるのなら。This nigga is talking from experience。仮物の理想を抱いて。Talking from experience again, Archer. I see, I see the games you play, bro. 
like they want that shit. A lie of a lie. The music. All right, man. Oh, -wee. I'm just ninety percent sure. Kiddo is Archer and Archer is Shiddo. I'm just ninety percent sure. I'm ninety percent sure. Ninety. Nothing can shrug me off the ninety right now. Nothing that you guys can say in the comments can sway me from believing that Shiddo and Archer is in the same person. But again, there's obviously some plot holes to what I'm saying because I don't know exactly how it would work because. I feel like it involves some time traveling BS that I'm just not familiar with this in the, in this verse yet, but I figured it out. I think I figured it out. Ah, <laughs> shoot. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right, so there's clearly some time travel bullshit happening that i'm just not clocking onto let's say, let's say time travel exists in this verse and it's happening i mean it slightly does in some next concepts but in the concept in a concept of like servants from the past being able to like um be alive in present day there, that's some type of time travel bs happening let's say but let's say time travel bs is happening the only way it ever happens is because of the grail so what if Right? Oh, chat, bear with me. What if Archer was sh the Shido who won the Holy Grail? Wished to go back in time to the days where he was an Archer and to the days where he was a kid living out his beautiful life. But because you know how corrupt the fucking Grail is. And then he, they, they, they spawned him. They spawned him in that fiery fucking scenario with Karitsugu, Kirei, and Gilgamesh. And that's the only reason he was the only one left alive. The only reason he was the only one alive in that situation was because he got spawned there by the Holy Grail. And so now this is Shiro living his second life. But, but this art... Do you get what I'm saying, Chad? Do you, uh, I, I can't explain it because I'm really shy at explaining myself. But do you understand where I'm going with this? There's some time travel Doctor Who bullshit happening and I'm seeing through it. I'm seeing through it. I'm seeing through it, bro. Now you reach... I don't think I'm reaching, bro. I might be. I might be reaching. But that's the... Like, for my theory of Shiro being Archer and Archer being Shiro and how it could happen... The only thing on his in his verse that can ever make it happen is the Holy Grail. Anyway, um, that was a very like wishy washy ping pong review of this episode. Um, but it is what it is, right? So if you enjoy my reaction, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, comment down below what you thought. Early and uncut reactions are on my Patreon. Link is in the description. By the way, if I'm correct about whatever I just said, you will see a man on your screen bust the biggest nut of your... I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. Psycho